You're welcome. Mama, I brought you bread. For you and Papa. We don't need your bread. Take it back. We have enough bread in this house. Mama, this one is a very special one. That I went from the bakery. You will like it. And I said we don't need it. We don't need your bread. Take it home for Hmm? Let me ask you. What of your husband? That's your rich husband. I heard he has plenty of money. How is he? Mama, that man is not my husband. Eh? That man is very wicked. Mm -hmm. He's been mean to me. I don't want to talk about him. Mm -hmm. I had to leave his house. Huh? I'm no longer married to him. Yeah. Story. Story. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you this. That man is a devil. He doesn't take care of me. He's very, very mean. He beats me. Mama, you will not understand. I just thank God I left his house and I'm still alive today. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Story. Hey, hey Mama. I heard my Olisa. No, my Olisa told me that she will be coming around. You are who? I don't know if he has arrived yet. Who is your Olisa? Who is your Olisa? Shut up! Shut up your smelly mouth. Let me ask you, what business do you have with Olisa? Mama, please. I beg you, help me and heal me, Papa. I am very, very sorry. I know I have wronged both you and Papa. And I'm not supposed to be here to beg for your forgiveness. Please, I am very, very sorry. Mama, the truth is that since I left this house, I haven't been myself. The thought of Olisa makes me lose my mind. I'm sorry, please forgive me. You are a shameless girl. Hey. You are a shameless girl. Mama, be sorry. Let it not be that she used to visit Olisa. No. Let me tell you something. Olisa, my son is married. Hey. If you know what is good for you, take your shameless self to your house and go and be thinking of him there. Uh, I'm a mom, I'm Mama, please now, Papa. I take your own name. Mama, I'm begging you, please, Mama. Mama. Hey. Papa. Just get out of my face and drop it for me. Please, I'm sorry. Get out and drop it for me. If a man did like a other robo, when your mom do I you leaders have seen the kind of embarrassment I faced today. If you were there, you would shed tears for me. Yeah? I'm telling you, his parents just walked out on me as if I was so invincible. I was talking to them, they behaved as if. I was just wasting my time. The next thing was they stood up and left. If the ground could open, I would have ate. Oh, nanny. I didn't know you had no shame. So you had the face to go to that house again after what you did to their son. Eh? I think you do not know how much I love Olisa. Love? Yes. How much do you love Olisa? Please tell me. Oh, please leave me. Before you start looking for someone you, you will blame now. Please. Do you know you are very confused? I have never seen anyone as confused as you are in this life. You are just shameless. Hey. Hey, are you are you with me or not? Because I don't understand you. Why are you talking to me as if I'm a child? Because you act like one. You act like a child. Look from Naya, if I were you, I will leave this village and will not return in years. Who else? Why? A parent? Please, from Naya, please. I am begging you in the name of God. Do not come to my house with your problems. I have my own problems. If you are looking for someone to talk to, talk to your mother. She knows it all. Please. Oh, we're on the go, 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 go,
Roasting yam for you. I know you like roasted yam. Hey. Since when did you become this humble? Papa. Papa was never a bad fellow. It's just that Mama deceived me. You became a bad girl the day you disobeyed me and married that crazy fool. Papa, I've tried in so many ways to make you understand that I'm really, really sorry for what I did. Please, Papa, forgive me. I'm sorry. I think you sorry, Papa. I know you are sorry indeed. But you know that no matter how fast a wound heals, the scars remain. something. I can see that you now feel that you have the right to enter inside my house, my store and take whatever you like, right? What kind of a mother are you? It is very obvious to me now that you don't have conscience. You don't have it. Would you at least sit down for a minute and think? Think about the terrible things you've done. Can't you think? Look at what you've done to me. You kept me in this terrible condition. You misled me, Mama. Yes. You can't show any remorse. Not even me too. You can't show any remorse. I don't have a conscience. I should be the one that would be remorseful. You're the one that should be remorseful. You married a good man. A man that has money. That took care of you. You said it yourself. Rather than being a good wife, you went there, messed up yourself, and they sent you back home. Let me warn you. Don't you ever enter my kitchen nor my store to carry any of my foodstuff. Do you understand what I'm saying? No sense. <laughs> What kind of mother are you? Don't hey! I feel like going away from that house. That house is like hell to me. When I walk in the village, people, people point at me, say nasty things about me, gossip with my name. I'm frustrated. I'm really frustrated. I wish, I wish you had listened to me. I wish you had listened to your father. All these things wouldn't have been happening. 
now even my own father sees me as an outcast. He doesn't eat my food. My father doesn't eat what I cook. When I'm in the house, he practically runs away because he doesn't want to see me. What could be more than that? That is how bad it has become. But do you blame him? You don't have to blame him. All you need to do is just ask him for forgiveness. He has not even given me the opportunity to, to ask him for forgiveness. He hasn't even given me the opportunity to come any inch close to him. You don't need him to give you the chance or the opportunity to talk to him. You have to create a means and ask him for forgiveness. Just go home and try and talk to him. Okay? I know I have let you down. I have failed you and I have disrespected you in so many ways. Oh, Papa, please. Please. Papa, I am here to ask for your forgiveness. If you don't forgive me, my life will be more miserable than it is now. Please. Get up. No. Papa, I will never get up. Until you forgive me, I won't. Funaya, get up. I have forgiven you. Sudden return is because of Fumnaya. Ma, it's just that Fumnaya is not a good girl. She's changed. Hey! Did you hear him? Hey! You've heard him. 
Hey! Yes, Mommy. Who is that? Hey! What have you done to my son? What have you done to you? They are used to do it. Nobody used to do it. They have cast a spell on you. Man, nobody yeah. cast anything on me. Something is wrong with you. All I know is that there is no way a lion can pick up a goat. Anything they must have done to him, huh? it will not work so long as I'm alive. No sense. Hey! 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 hey. hey. What have they done to you? Aha! Ghosts of my ancestors. Will you be there and watch me going to sleep? Nowhere. <laughs> These people have decided to destroy my son, but they will not succeed. No. If it is from the moon, I reject it. Is it from the sand here? Yeah? I send it back to center. Is it from the air? Let it follow the air. Anywhere they did it, let it not work in my soul. It will not have any power to work in my soul. They cannot take him away from me. No way. Even if he ate it, they give it to him and ate it with his, with his mouth. It cannot. I mean, whether it is done by a man or a woman, living or dead, it will not work. I will not have any effect on my son. What's yes. the meaning of this? <laughs> Wait, my son. Let me cleanse you. Cleanse you how? Cleanse you from the hands of evil. Uh, uh, stop, stop. Uh, what is the meaning of all this? This is what is called cleansing. Like those people that have caged you. And you're busy thinking about from Naya. You don't know anything like him now. Ah, uh, you're making this thing look like a war. It is war. War indeed. Do you know that this is war? This war, the war, the war is already on. Eh? Or oh, do you want me as an, as an elder to sit, down, so, sit back at home and watch the she goat deliver in the theater? Eh? Look, I will not be alive and watch somebody home. Somebody. Put his finger into my nose. Eh? The battle is on and you're talking about war. Look at what is happening now. They have hypnotized you because I know that girl. But there is no need for all this. There is no need. But I'm, I'm, I'm not involved with this at all. I'm, don't, don't even count me on it. I, I, you're just wasting time. What, what's this? You have, you have not even listened to me for once. Eh? Only are you involved with? I'm, I'm not. I don't, I don't understand this. What? You are from the lineage of the lions. And lions do not feed on grass. John, I call you. Police is actually in the village just because of Fumana. Yeah. What Fumana are you talking about? It's the same ungrateful girl. The same Fumana who broke your heart. I followed another man. She has left her husband's house. And my son wants to bring her. Want to take her. No. Want to take her. No. Ask him. To Did she use to join you? Did she charm you? Ask him. Ask him. <laughs> You mean you want to settle for a woman who almost ruined your life? Eh? What kind of madness is that? Ask eh? you. It's all happened. It's all happened. It is not madness. It is surprising and strange that you're joining Papa and Mama to, 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 to treat me like a small boy. Are you not a boy? Only that. Are you not a boy? Only for water. You are a child. You are a small boy. What is all this? You are still out. And there is this one, Even if your head touches the sky, you still will win our song. Anyway, the truth is that if I had known that this is the reason why Papa called me for this meeting, I wouldn't have answered to it. And as it is right now, I have to take my leave. Eh? Excuse me. What is that? Hey! What is that, Hey! Hey! This is what the only you to know. Yasin! Hey! Maya, 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 I'm not in That was why I called you to come and witness for yourself. Because if a man sees a snack, eh? he can turn it to be a person. How can a man take into his arm the same dog that beat his manhood? This is not ordinary. They have gone to a tedious business. And that will not work. It will not work for them. I can be here and fold my hands and watch them. Eh? Ruin my only son. It's not impossible. It will not work. 
show them why I'm calling you. Eh? They will see the reason I'm calling you, guys. I will not watch them. It's not always Tension high. What happened? Oh, not something I want to talk about. No, 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 no. We have to talk about it. I hope you're not having problems with your parents because of whom Naya. No, 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 no. Your mother complains bitterly about it. And honestly, when she was complaining, I thought she was joking. And I told her I will talk to you. Thank God I've seen you now. What's the problem? Like I said before, it's not something I want to talk about. But I want to go somewhere. We have to discuss it. Because you're my friend. And as good friends, I have to be honest with you. I hope you're not planning or thinking of going back to that girl. No, seriously, if if you do, I I, I will see you as a man who throws at his speed and goes back to the legit. Saying it is because if you're crying, it's me you will come to. Hmm? I, I don't want you to go back to her again. Don't forget what she did to you. She dealt with you. You need to follow me. So we'll look for a place to relax and at least take the fresh Well, talking about going to jail. Do you have money with you? She's waiting. Well, listen. As your friend, I want you to tell me the truth. Are you still interested in Fumnana? Does he look to you? Like I'm still interested in that. You want to ask him a question? Yeah, but I'm asking it back to you. I'm putting it back to you. Have I, at any point in time, discussed the issue concerning from Naya? Whether I want her back or not? The way you're going about it shows that. Oh, yeah, Ka! Yes? Are we going to drink or not? Listen, this girl treated you so bad. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Are you going to drink or you want me to leave it right so that you can continue on your own? Understand why one will not have rest in his father's house. Yeah. This is my father's house. Melissa! So, I want to answer my question. I want to know why you walked out on us because you said you will not marry that wicked girl. That wicked girl! Eh? I think this is the reason why you let your husband's house. Vafa, yeah. please. You come here and start disturbing us. Is it fair? No, it's not important. It's not important. You think we will stay alive and allow some. Just cover your head. You think that will happen? It will not happen. It won't. That's no good. 
everybody is going to join me. Um, okay. See here. And that's the reason you want to bring back the same girl. The same girl that almost ruined your life. <laughs> My life is not ruined. I've said that to you before. My life is... See the way my son is talking. My son is talking like someone the head is inside the evil forest. Like a man. Which man? Which man? Hey! Your heart is still with that girl. No, now my wife. It will not happen. It won't happen. You will not marry that girl. You won't marry that girl. You are just stressing yourself, aunt. You are stressing yourself for nothing. That is not good for your health. So who are saying is not important to you, eh, Odisa? It's not important. Enough. Okay, now we'll see. Oh, you land, hear my voice. The spirit of my ancestors, bear ye me now witness. You that guide within the four walls of this compound, that I am not in support of my son marrying Fumunaya. But if he goes ahead and marries her, my spirit will forever torment him. So be it. Whatever that they have done, wherever that they have gone to, that thing will not work. I promise you, it will not work. I will call my pastor to and tell him all these things that is happening here. Because we cannot sit and allow this thing to happen. It won't happen, no. Eh? Where is it? Holy sir! Holy sir, where are you from? here? Ghosts of our land. The spirit of my ancestors, I call to appease you with this color. I am from the lineage of the lions. And whoever touches the tail of a lion must be beaten by it. Ulisa, good that you are here. If you dare marry that girl, you know what I will do. I will get into this house, lock up myself there, and set myself ablaze. Then my spirit will always torment you. And I will join you. I will join you. Let's give Olita the chance to dance this dance of shame. Mm -hmm. dance, dance, dance this dance of shame. If anything happens to my brother, if anything happens to my brother, I will gather the old mother here and they will place a cuff on you. Let me on that. Do you know that that's going to happen? What? Look at him. No. This is Juju now. This is Juju in action. Auntie, there's nobody using spell on me. No Juju on me. I'm normal. You are normal. Yes. Do you look normal? Do you look normal? Like this. Yeah, I, don't, I don't understand this. I want to go out. You are going where? I am going out. Jesus. Will you sit down there? Sit down there! Fool! You are going where? I said sit down. Listen, if you dare step out of this place now, I will just place a curse upon you. No, sir. Look at But why are you talking to me as if I'm a child, sir? Shut up your mouth and sit down! down. Holy sir, you are a small boy. You must listen to your father. Sit down. Sit down, Holy sir. Sit, sit down. down. Sit down. Sit down! If you step an inch here, only if you step an inch here, you will visit Mongo back today. Just leave him. Let him try it. Watch my office. Hello? Oh, thank God. Hello, Pastor, please. Are you still around? Oh, thank God. Please, can you come to my brother's house? Eh? The devil wants to steal and destroy. Please, can you come quickly, please? Eh? It's very urgent. Eh, yeah. okay, you're coming. Thank you. Please hurry, hurry, we are waiting. What? Thank you. God forbid. God forbid that I will allow this to happen. You see that girl? That girl and her mother have failed. They will know that I serve a powerful God. A God that I worship can never allow this to happen. I tell you that. But Auntie, I told, I told you there is no juju on me. Eh? <laughs> see this one? You hear yourself? People talk when they are under a spell if you don't know that. Let me tell you. Do you hear me? That is how they talk. Nobody is even interested in hearing my own opinion. Uh, you people are just talking Shut like up your mouth. Which opinion? Which nonsense opinion? Shut I want to go out. I told you people that before. You are going where? I said sit down and don't go to anywhere. Sit down. Yes, sir, sit down. Are you out of yourself? Listen to your father. Right? Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Is it because I left you at this while? You are showing disobedience. What's wrong with you? I've got pain outside. Go. Oh, if you stop out of here, I will go back to Pastor is here. Pastor, thank God you are here. An evil woman cast a spell on my nephew. Please, 
The devil is the devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. In Jesus' name, Father, we thank you for a day like this. May the way you delivered Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, we want you to deliver this young man in Jesus' name. Father, we thank you for a day like this because we know you have done it. Because we know you have delivered for a day like this. Why did you ask me before? <laughs> okay, let's hear it. Talk, let's hear it. Anyway, let me just say it. In case you people were thinking that I came into this village because of Funaya, it's a lie. I did not come because of Funaya. Why then are you in the village this week? Because I have a surprise for you people, Papa. Surprise? Yes, Papa. What kind of surprise can come from you if not the topics of Funaya? There you go wrong, Papa. There you go wrong. Because it's not only the elderly that knows everything. You should have asked me first. That's the point. That's why I said you nobody listen to me. Nobody. Okay. So what's the surprise? But I found a woman that I want to marry. Hmm? And she's coming here today. <laughs> Story. <laughs> okay. Who is she? My sister is uh, one of the daughters of the Cantis. Our Cantis here. But well, look at me now. I'm, I'm happy expecting a visit. Look at her, I'm of life. Hello, Mama. Hello,
I will not disobey you again. I know I have wronged you so deeply. I'm sorry. Forgive me. So you think after insulting me, you can just come and ask for forgiveness and you expect me to forgive you, huh? No, you, you, you think it's that easy, right? Hmm? I don't know how, 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 how mad I can be. Now I'll tell you. By the time I go in there and come out. No, my husband, don't change your face. You know, whenever you change your face, your, your anger is always very bad. Please. Please, my husband, don't change your face. Please, don't I saw in this original marriage, ministers, senators, medical doctors, government officials. Hey! 
Papa, where from, sir? Papa, no. Uh, you are in our house? Yes, sir. You are welcome. <laughs> Did you see what I saw over there? Papa, that is exactly what I'm telling you, Kumanya. This is one in town. I've never seen this before. That's wonderful. I've never seen such a thing all my life. Me too. I never knew that little girl knew people of that caliber in their numbers. Everywhere. Police was dancing on Monday. Hey! Police got married today. He's not a prayerful to you. And I'm not ready to take that from you. Thank you very much. Onisa got married today. If you are, if you are, if you, if you are, if you don't believe what you are saying, go and see for yourself. Onisa got married today. It is still happening. Papa, I don't understand you. got married and you never told me. I don't know. Hmm. But he got married today. Uh, before I forget, I have to go and prepare dinner for my father. Oh, you still late. She's just joking. Oh, Lisa cannot be married. Papa! You know you did. You did love me the first day. Who said so? I did. I saw it in your eyes. No. I was just getting lost in your beauty. <laughs> <laughs> well, the truth about it, I didn't know it's going to start. So that I don't get too upset. Most of you now told me that you're medical doctor. Oh my god. <laughs> I said I'm finished. <laughs> well, I mean, I never would have believed it that you would have accepted a man like myself. She's a trader. I mean a businessman. A common man for that matter. Mm, maybe you're not common. Nothing about you is coming here. Don't you ever, ever qualify yourself as such thing again. Thank you. <laughs> You're my hero. You're my hero. Glad you saw that. Mm. The moment I set my eyes on you, there is this thing. Don't know what it's about. It's just started falling me to you. You know? The way you smile. Your structure, I just say to myself, this is the kind of man I need in my husband. Mm. Everything about you was just so perfect. And then, you asked me out for lunch. And I said, thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, because this is prayer answered. My husband had answered my prayer. And he answered it. Yes, he did. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, my daughter. How are you? I'm fine. Good morning. 
Did you pack clothes from my bed? Yes, I did. I wanted to help you to wash them. Oh, thank you. God bless you. Thank you, Ma. Thank you. I, I hope you slept well. I slept well, my dear. Mama. Please do come and rest. Yeah. You need to rest. I will rest when I'm done, okay? You need to rest. Mama, you're the one that needs help, okay? You've been doing nothing by yourself. Let me assist you. Thank you. Just hurry up so that you have to rest, right? Just go and wait until you be done, alright? Yes. You're taking to the city. Uh -uh, Mama, you don't have to bother yourself, eh? We're supposed to be the ones giving you, not the other way around, eh? My dear, you always have the right to work tonight. <laughs> okay, Mama, let me take this inside. Okay. Come on, Oh, Fum Nayo, how are you? I'm fine, Mama. Fum Nayo, how are you? Fum Nayo, how are you? You are now a doctor. Yes, my dear, I am. All, all thanks to God. Mm. All thanks to God. I'm so happy for you. Ah, you both know each other. Yes, Mama. We attended the same school together. Yes. <laughs> what are you doing here? I came to see. Mama, is Olisa around? Oh, mm, Olisa is around. Call your husband for her. Okay. Sweetheart. Sweetheart. Yes. Madeline, husband, please, because I don't want to see you. Who is that? Uh. What is going on? Mm. 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 Mm
Mama. Mama. Hmm? What is going on? <laughs> Excuse me. My husband. <laughs> what was the meaning of that? What are you not telling me? Okay, my dog, I don't really want to discuss that for my girl. I don't want to discuss her issue at all. Just tell me whatever it is between you. Whatever it is. Anyway, if you insist on knowing. Because that's all night. We were actually dating in a relationship that I had to sacrifice everything to make sure she graduates from the university. And we had agreed that we were going to get married by this January that passed. What did I get in return? She abandoned me. She and her mother. She followed one man that they, they felt was very rich. Now she's coming back to look for what I do not know. My husband, is it the same? Same girl, and you told me. Yes, she did, but I think she was the one. I don't even see. She's the one. I suffer for this girl. I labored. There were even times that I didn't have at all. I went abroad to make sure she was comfortable at school. At the end of the day. Left me in the middle of nowhere. Coming back for what? I'm here to mend your heart. I'm here to mend your heart. She doesn't know what it means to have a man that is real to the bone. Love your love love Anyway, I, I, I came to inform you that Onyeka and his family are coming to pay my price right next week. <laughs> Take this thing. Open the car, open the front side and put everything put inside. In. Put it at the back seat. We have food in the city. We have enough. This one is for me. Okay. Okay. This is uh, uh, village home. How many weeks are we going to give this one now? Okay, I want your husband to grow fat when next is going to come to you. <laughs> Mama, I'll feed him fat, don't worry. Why would I grow fat with all these things? And you, Olisa. When next he will come, I won't see your wife in the issue. Mama, you, you trust your son, man. You come, man. See the position. Um, that position I'm using to carry him, I didn't say that. Feeding fat, you know, I'm not going to. I'm going to. Papa. Mama. Take care of this one, bro. I will, Mama, mm -hmm. I will. Take care of yourself too. Okay, <laughs> Hey, Papa. Papa. Take care. Eh? Oh. Mm. Take care of yourself. Take care. Oh. You want to help me? Hey, let me help you. Don't stay in hand. I will not.
Agun, I am proud of you. You will make a good husband. Bim 